All right, it says I'm live. We'll find out here in a second for sure. I'm gonna start a stream of cursing. You tell me when I get to the offensive words. Boogerhead. Poopy face. Knuckle, knuckle nose. Anything there yet? Hey, Chad, how's it going? Marshall, 157 for sure. All right, I had to do it at a weird time today. Hey, Michael, happy Labor Day evening. Kevin, because I have brisket tacos and my wife is on her way home, so she's going to stop at the store. So I think I have just enough time to get all the information out that I need to get out. Number one, we're going to wait a few minutes here, and then we're going to do... Yeah. <laughs> I've gone too far. <laughs> Number one, first thing we're going to do tonight, once we get a few more people in here, is we're going to do the giveaway, the the giveaway that we've been following all week. I got some extra SMKW swag. I got a couple blades. It's all going to go in one box for the winner of this giveaway. Then, hey Doc, welcome. I'm so glad you're here, Doc. I'm so glad you're here. <laughs> Then we're going to talk about the 4,000 sub giveaway that I got to do. We got to do that this week because next month is going to be the third anniversary of the Jimmy Slash channel knife. Well, the knife portion of it. I mean, the frog portion has been around for years. But the knife portion, third anniversary is next month. So I want to do something for that too. So we can get rid of all these giveaways really, really quickly. But... If you have any friends or people that don't follow the live stream, I'm doing the, I'm going to do the 4,000 sub giveaway through the live stream because this is the reason, because a lot of times I announce a giveaway or a big giveaway like that and then 700 people that never watch the, the live stream or never watch the videos pop out of the woodwork and that's fine. I understand that, but for this one, I'm going to make it a little bit more little bit more special just for the folks that are actually active and following and take part in the live stream so if you want to warn them let them know that's fine I don't mind a bunch of people showing up for the live stream but that's where it's going to be is going to be in the live stream and it's going to be over the next three live streams and we'll tell you all the particulars about that in a second or not a second a few minutes after we get all the other stuff out of the way <laughs> hey John Yeah, ready. Yeah, we hate them. I don't hate them. You know what? I've been using the heck out of this. I got this in a, I think in like a package buy. Bought a bunch of knives. And this one was in it. And I just didn't pay attention to it. And I pulled it out of the box today. This thing is really cool. This little carbon fiber pillar. I like it. It's light and it's slicey. I think I'm going to hold on to this for a while. As far as using it. So, I like this one a lot. That's a cool one. And then I opened this one here. I kind of like this one, but the only thing I don't like is it's one of those button release assisted things. Check this out. And it snaps open right-handed. Left-handed, I'm getting that blur feeling from it. Like, oh, yeah, see, it scares me. Like, yeah, that's going to leave me lacerated one of these days. And I can't do it over and over again. Yeah, see? <laughs> that's scary to me. So... I don't know about the Moxie left-handed. Right-handed, the Moxie is really cool. And in hand, if this thing was unassisted, this thing would be awesome. It's got the little choil here, you know, I like. But in the hand, it's just kind of a really cool liner lock, EDCable knife. But with that thing there on there, it's tricksy for sure. Right-handed, super snappy, really cool. So I might be re review re reviewing these this week. Got some other stuff in. Let's see who else is coming in here. I haven't made the tacos yet. That's why I'm talking so fast. Got the wife coming home. She's bringing guacamole fixings and keto candy bars. It's going to be a good evening. We kick back and watch a movie. Who uses their left hand? I use my left hand. There we go. That was a good one. See, if I could do that every time, it would be okay. But most of the time, I'm scared of this thing. <laughs> Who's her? Who's her? Anyway, this is a cool little knife. That's what I was wondering, John. I was thinking about de-assisting it. I may do that after I review it and see if I can. 
because it's like the in the hand it's kind of like the lck is that what it's called the lck not the sheep's footy one but the other one it's kind of like that and i think it'd be a really cool knife and with the assist right-handed it's really cool I mean, i'm getting better at that i might just have to keep that <clears throat> hey carbonite welcome fix that clip on the pilar yeah i will i'll flip that back around for sure all right let's see what else did we do this week oh it was mom's birthday so i got her a couple things but this is the one i'm really excited to get her so she can beat me up and uh call me names and stuff <laughs> this is actually an idea from somebody else but anyways i went and got her the, the gold leg rough rider oh it's kind of cool if she doesn't like it i might hold on to this it's like a major award that's what it's like so <laughs> i got her that and i got her some other stuff for her birthday so she was a. Uh, she hasn't seen any of it yet because it just came in kids are watching willy wonka scary boat scene just happened i don't remember the scary boat scene i've only seen either of those one time so no, I'm not going to give mom the booty knife. <laughs> I might give her a fish bat. I, I, did, I am going to give her a knuck. So she can have a knuck in her purse and a out the front. A microtech out the front. <laughs> she loves breaking that thing out at her ladies' meetings. It just cracks her up. She was telling me the other day about it. She did it again. Just whoosh, flip that thing out. Oh, Rosa, what are you doing? But, uh. Hey, JCB, welcome. I'll let her know, Johnny, you said happy birthday. That's nice, thank you. Okay, let's see here, what else we got here? I think we already checked these out. Yeah, I already checked these out. These are not supposed to be up here, in fact. I'm gonna send out some presents this week for birthdays and whatnots. And what's your nots. All right, so, let's see. Okay, this is how it's gonna go. If you've been paying attention to the videos this week, there's been three videos that I gave out some secret numbers in, and now's the time that numbers are gonna come, become important. So if you add up all the numbers in those videos, this is Trixie, but I warned you, this is Trixie. So if you add up all the numbers in those videos, let's see, there was that one, there was that one. Okay, I have the number in my head you have to uh to let's see how many do this yeah just post it post the number right now and then posting is not going to do it because then some of you cheaters are going to cheat and post the same number because then i have a backup plan so if you know the number go ahead post the number if you don't we're going to do it again we'll do it again on wednesday what is the secret number you have to follow the videos. Oh, that's not it, Mark. Oh, no, that's not it either. I think everybody's just guessing now. <laughs> that's, not, that's not in here. <laughs> oh, man. All right, nobody knows the number. It's not 157. <laughs> Noobers. <clears throat> oh, man. I thought this was going to go better. There's a lot of people threatening to unsubscribe for sure. All right. All right. So I guess nobody's going to get it. All right. 
I'm gonna give you like 10 more seconds. All right, we're gonna carry this on. We'll carry this on Wednesday. I'll post another number video between now and then, and then we'll see if we can get it there. All right, so the giveaway keeps on going. It's gonna keep on, keep on rolling here. Oh, it's okay, Chris. It's just for fun. It's no big deal. It's not a big deal at all. <clears throat> All right. So we'll, what we'll do is we'll go ahead and I'll post another video. And then we'll go from there. So Wednesday. Wednesday's going to be a late one though. So there's our wrestling Wednesday. Yeah, there was three videos. Three videos with the numbers in them. So Wednesday. I'll post another video. And oh yeah, quit y'all quit guessing. <laughs> I'm not gonna answer now. The guesses are just gonna keep coming in as guesses. So is uh, Wednesday would try it again. That's okay. I, it's no big deal. It, don't get upset. It's just for fun. Um, so here's the other deal. We're gonna do what we're gonna do for the the 4,000 sub giveaways. We're going to do a Nubers, a Nubers, a Nubers, what you call a draw. So the Nubers will be, uh, we'll do a Nubers tonight. Then we're going to do a Nubers Wednesday. And then we'll do the final Nubers on Friday. And then, my, my brain's going crazy. I'm just, the cat's over here meowing, trying to get out of her room. The final Nubers will do on Friday, and then I'll do a drawing of the three Nubers winning. Now you're gonna want to do, you're gonna want to be here for the Nubers. One, of, you gotta get in for some of the Nubers because the box I'm putting together for the four thousand sub giveaway is gonna be insane. It's gonna be pretty awesome. <clears throat> okay, if you keep posted the num the numbers from the Nuber the videos somebody else is gonna get it so that's a no-no so but I'm not gonna take any more guesses so did weekly Nubers die yeah weekly Nubers died it kind of just went away for a little bit it just that everybody was jumping in for Nubers at the last minute and showing up for Nubers and not showing up for anything else so it kind of went away. Nubers is a surprise now. If you're here, there might be a Nubers. If not, it's okay. Hey, DC, welcome. Yeah, we're giving away Chad's Halo 6. That's the first thing we're going to give away. I don't think Chad... Does Chad have a Halo 6? I never heard about that. I didn't know about that. All right. So we'll do a Nubers tonight. And then we will do a, a Nubers Wednesday really late. Not late for some of you, but it'll be about 11 o'clock, 12 o'clock my time, depending on when practice gets out and when I learn to type again. Physical challenge about, yep. Yeah, I won't be winning the Halo 6. <clears throat> hey, any of y'all uh, take any excellent supplements for weightlifting or anything? thinking that I need some supplementation. I take a, a joint compound, but I don't take anything as far as, like, I don't know, recovery or anything like that. What are y'all taking out there in beef land, beefcake world? Anybody taking anything that they can recommend highly? All right, let me see what else we got here. I got a couple knives I'm going to be reviewing this week. I might be reviewing this one. Did I review this one? I don't remember. Did I review the tops? I don't think I think I showed it to you. Steroids. That's my next bet. That's the next place I'm going. Tom, tonight. We're gonna do it right now. Pretty quick here. Next 10, 15, 20 minutes or so. HG, so nothing 
Nothing I can get at GNC, huh? <laughs> C4 Way Mon Protein Monster Energy. My name's kind of not good. Just meth. Meth, yeah, that never ending workout. You're super focused. Super focused on the workouts. All right. I got to do a review on this one this week. I got a couple more knives to review from the Smoky Mountain Batch. Oh, I got to review this one. I'm probably going to throw a bunch of these together into a review. I got a couple of Rough Riders that need to be reviewed. There you go. Oh, that's a cool knife. That Buckshot Bone Trapper. Yeah, it's a Trapper, right? No, it's a Barlow. Aha! You almost got me. Yeah, it's a Barlow. Buckshot Bone tr Barlow Trapper. Drink raw eggs. Anger. <laughs> This is crack cocaine, steroids, HGH, and meth. Those are the top four so far. And turn my hat backwards. Whole blood D ball. That's my 13 year old. <laughs> Dang. He's going to be jacked really quick here. That's a lot, that's a lot of money there. <laughs> All right. Listen to Tiny Tim. Yeah, that'll make you angry. Make you want to hurt somebody for sure. Okay. Let's see what else I got. Get away, Frederick. Move. I don't got nothing for you, Frederick. Go away. Here, go, go chase that. There you go. <laughs> Bingo kitty. All right. I think that's it for things. I haven't gotten anything in. I've been trying to sell stuff, trying to save up some money. I haven't gotten anything new in to show you guys. How about y'all? Y'all got anything coming in? Hey, Benny, welcome. The blood of my defeating. I gotta defeat some enemies first. It's a it's a violent circle, a vicious circle. When I raced MTB, they gave me stuff and I just never asked any questions. <laughs> yeah, that's the way the guys in the NFL do it. I don't know, I was taking a supplement and uh, it had DECA in it. <laughs> it had Equipose in my smoothie. Dirty trainers. Press your fingers in the way place and go. Pain. Well, a lot of good ideas here. A bunch of them that are going to land me in, cell, in the cell with a, somebody that probably knows what he's doing. Found a Spyderco Pegasus. Okay. No, I sold it, Rob. I got it sold. Somebody bought, somebody bought the uh, Provoke. Oh, hey, it's Slicey. I, oh, okay. <laughs> Welcome. Microtech Direct. Oh, I want to check one of those out really badly. That's awesome. It's got that Infidel switch on there, which makes it infinitely better. <laughs> Bought two new suits today. It's hard to spend money on work stuff compared to nice Yeah, but suits, man, they look good on you. Suits. Eagerly waiting my waffle box. Yeah, that's going to be a good box. Can't wait for you to get it. That's a good box. What's in the top sheet? This is that folding fieldcraft knife that I got. Pretty awesome knife. Locked up seriously solid. I like to beat on it a while and kind of show you guys what it can do. I didn't get any chopping, brisket chopping videos done today. But I was kind of in a hurry. Lots of unlabeled bottles and tubes. And and the cream. The Barry Bonds cream. Have a Defcon fixed blade buoy coming in. Ooh, that's nice. Yeah, once I go to jail, figure out what they're eating. It ain't ramen. Those dudes are humongous. Got my Rough Rider Marine Combat Sword a couple days ago. Yeah, nice. Yeah, that thing's awesome, right? <laughs> yeah, it's a vicious, vicious killer. Folding bob, basically. Yeah, that's what it is, Rob. It's, it's totally a folding bob. That's all it is. It's, it's awesome. Inmates doing on a diet of ramen and a lot of bench pressing and push ups, so they're ripped with the gut. Yeah, but you can get some crazy stuff in prison. You can get some uh, some juice down there. Got, those guys got to be juicing. Some of those dudes are humongous. 
I have a couple S and W medals coming, I think. Okay, cool. Hey Pete, welcome. I might look good in orange. No, man. <laughs> I look terrible in orange. I look like a the, the great pumpkin. <laughs> I don't want to wear orange. <laughs> and I, I don't need any vertical stripes either. <laughs> Start making a Viking battle axe today. That's awesome. Really cool. Oh, boy, Chef's Knife. That would be awesome. Seriously, I'll check that out on Kickstarter. That's pretty cool. Jailhouse Strong is a book on how to get jacked. I think also Tijuana Barbell Club is another. Oh, cool. I'll check those out. Right, I just might too, be too old to get strong as I need to get. Strong as I want to get, at least. Hey, Todd. Welcome. Still enjoying my lawn. Swish, swish, swishy. Hey, Christine, welcome. Still to the Crooked River. Don't know about the orange backspacer, though. Oh, I like, see, a lot of people don't like that. I like the orange backspacer on that one. If not, can't you get the G10 one? You can always get that G10. Or probably find somebody that makes a custom backspacer, too. Oh, man. Let's see here. All right, Cookie Gear is great. No, go away, Frederick. I'm not gonna throw you. All right, I'll throw it. Go away. Yeah, the Crooked River is a good knife. It's an awesome knife. You really don't know until you get in hand. It looks really kind of cool, and then you get in hand, it just makes makes a lot of sense. It's just it's like a really cool buck knife. Or you could dye it, yeah. JCB, he's right. You could dye it. <clears throat> hey, Eddie, welcome. <laughs> oh, you didn't miss much. We're just uh, talking about giveaways and what people have coming in and what they're thinking about getting. All righty. Okay, what we're going to do, let's see. I don't know how much longer I got before. Oh, I got plenty of time. All right, we're good to go. Got a handful of spidey holes and a Microtech last week. Cool. Which Microtech did you get? Nobody knows the Microtech. All right. Let me see here what else is going on. Like I said, I don't have anything coming in. And I'm just waiting, waiting to find something to, to purchase. Kind of just in the uh, middle of waiting. That's all I'm doing. But I got a bunch of stuff to to review for sure. My Carter RR Warncliff is awesome. It is awesome. Very good. Hey, Sue, I'm doing good. Doing really good. i given a number, taking number on the giveaway videos. No, it's all going to be together. All the numbers will be together. Got another copper tradition. Nice. I was using that today. That thing is awesome. And a copper round under my field. Oh, thanks. That's awesome. Use the field link. That's really cool. We're going to need it. We're going to need it for um, shipping for sure. Got some people dropping out of Patreon. But I'll do some piffles and we'll get it all together for sure. But every little bit is going to help for sure on uh, Piffmas shipping. We'll see how that goes for sure. See, see how it works out. Mike, or MJ, I haven't turned in my tacos yet. That's why I'm talking so fast. She, My wife is coming home with some guacamole. And then we're going to make tacos here in a little bit. So... Oh, plus one, minus one? No, nope. it's pretty easy. It's pretty simple on the numbers. So I'm just going to have it to where it's nailed down. 
This fall will be tough for me on my new job is starting a few nights I want with a Nintendo Switch release. Calendar looks amazing. <laughs> yeah, my boy's got a Switch, so. I don't know what they're looking at buying, though. I've been playing a lot of Smash Brothers and Zelda. Need a rascal scooter for Piffmas. Ooh, oh, I'm not a rascal. Guess on how much I'm gonna need. As it stands right now, we're gonna need about 1,600 bucks at least. And that's if nobody else signs up. So right at 1,600 right now. I didn't grab any of the Olight discounts. I thought about it, but I got a whole drawer of Olights over here that I keep buying on discounts and flashlights and stuff. So there's uh, I always want more, but I don't really need any. I don't have it, Frederick. You have it over there. So I guess that's about it as far as things I got coming in. I can't think of anything else to announce or anything. I got the Nubers thing coming up. Don't forget to do that. For the people that just came in, we're going to do Nubers for the 4,000 sub giveaway this week. So that's what we're going to do. Yeah, only three... Three so far on that, on the uh, Nubers. On oh, three, four so far on the numbers giveaway. Can we all donate five bucks to Jimmy Sash versus Pumpkin Patch for Halloween? Yeah, I'll open up some pumpkins for sure. <laughs> It's going to be kind of tricky this year getting into Walmart because of all the garbage stuff that's been happening. But I'll definitely get a pumpkin and mess up something. A purple curse shuffle. Got on National Life Day. That's a good one. Got Chavez. That's awesome. That is really cool. That's a cool, cool win there. Getting that Chavez. Oh, the Highland Spike. I just saw mine. That's a great knife. It's in my box of stuff to review. And I know I already reviewed it, but for some reason it snuck back in there. But yeah. What would I like to see in the SMKW box? You know what I want to see is just value. I'm not looking for anything particular. It's just, I want just to where you open it and you're like, yeah. You don't have to sit there. You've seen some of those boxes and they're like stretching the value. And like, this one's kind of worth $38. So we'll round that up to 47, and if I round this down up to 62, then it makes sense of what I bought. I just want to see something that, you know, like I'd like to see in a bunch of the other ones, where you just, you, know, you didn't get exactly the knife you wanted, or you didn't get exactly the things you wanted, but you know that you got your money's worth. And that's what, I think that's what's going to be key to it being successful for sure, is where people don't have to, it's like the mystery boxes that I that I sell over there on Facebook or that I waffle on Facebook. Even if you spend, let's say there's 40 slots and you bought all of them, you if you open up the box, you're going to know that you got that much value out of it. And it's usually way more than that. It's So if you open up your box and you just look at it and you realize, yeah, so this makes sense as far as money-wise then I think a lot of people are going to be happy that way. If that makes sense. Don't get burned down aisle seven. Yeah, I think I'm going to walk into the bathroom and just do my damage in there and then just walk out and ask for a mop so I can clean up the pumpkin cuts so nobody shoots me while I'm over you know, next to the napkins mutilating a watermelon. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about, Strafe. You pay 100 bucks, and you're trying to figure out if there's $90 worth of stuff. I think folks can get turned off by that. And I think a lot of people, or a lot of the giveaway box, or no, the, the monthly program boxes are like that. I gave the AKC away, Marshall, to a, a friend's son who was turning 18, so he's finally legal, so I gave that to him. As is first out the front. So I don't have that anymore. 
Oh yeah, John. I've little doubt that it's gonna be awesome. They don't. They're pretty awesome over there. They're, I mean, they're out to make money, obviously, but they're such knife people. Not nice people, but knife people. Just, just like knives, and you, and you can kind of feel it that they do. Especially if you're around <laughs> them and you hear them talk and you get to spend some time with them. It was pretty cool. Especially Melina. She she knows a ton. I don't know anybody that knows as much about knife history as she does. It's insane. It's, it's just the stuff that comes out of her mouth about everything that is knife related. It's awesome. And the history of this company related to this company and how it works with this company and they're all intertwined. It's really cool to talk to her. So yeah, it's really awesome. <clears throat> yeah, I, I would sign up for a box. Definitely. I don't see a problem with that. Huh. <laughs> going on behind the scenes. <laughs> I don't know, in the that picture there was a, a spider co hanging out there. Oh yeah. Her sense of humor is awesome. She's a lot of fun. They're all really cool. Cool to meet, cool to hang out with. And just some of the best parts of Blade Show this year. Man, this thing is a mess. <laughs> Bad knife. Ow. Look at that. It's messing up my tender fingers. That's not tender fingers here. Look at that. It's like a dent in my memory foam finger. Can you see that? Yeah. Ouch. <clears throat> Let's see. Yeah, SMKW has a lot of a lot of brands for sure that they own. It's pretty cool. They know a lot of things. There's a lot of stuff over there. Frederick, you're blocking me in. All right, let's see. All right, let me see over here. She enables me and Chad's trolling. Yeah, she's awesome. I know, Chad. It is tender. It hurts. <laughs> That's why I need a direct <laughs> and not the other one. <laughs> you think you'd be okay if they put scratch and dent into the box if they told people ahead of time? I don't know. I don't think they're going to do that. I think maybe, you know, they would come out with a scratch and dent box, but I think, I don't know. I, it would have to be something pretty special. Scratched and dent. I just think, I think it's going to be cool. I think a lot of people are going to see what's in these first boxes and wish they'd sign up for the first box and we'll see them sign up for the second box. And probably with the updated officer package or whatnot yeah it would be cool if they announced it as a scratch and dent like you said but I don't know how much of a break you're going to get on price and stuff do, do, do. I don't know Cesar I don't know if they're, they've all sold out yet I haven't checked out Yeah, Christopher, the, that place is awesome. We, we were there for four or five hours, and we just barely got into it. I could have just went through the whole thing again, and then the next time I could have gone through just checking out what was on the walls. It was just really, really cool. That's a great trip. I can't wait to go back. Yeah, Todd, they have a monthly subscription box over there. They have three of them, three levels, and... One's the GI box, one's the NCO box, and then one's the officer level box. I don't remember exact pricing on it. I think it's 25, 60, and 99 or something like that. <clears throat> Distress is the way to sell a scuffed up knife for full price. 
<laughs> That's right. You know those Boba Fett bounty hunter distress knives. Oh, the whistle. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> yeah, I sent the kids running with the whistle. All right, let me get the Nuber over here. We can get the Nubers going for tonight. So tonight's Nuber will be the first entry into the 4,000 sub giveaway drawing that will happen. Let me get this going. All right, let me see if Doc is up for this. Make sure he can watch. If he can't watch, I'm gonna be. Oh, he can. All right. I almost said the. I almost said the number. Okay, here's the deal. For those of you who haven't been here before, remember. One hundred. It is a Moxie Peach. Yeah, it's a Moxie. Do you have one of these? One hundred to two hundred and fifty. Is are the outside the numbers? The numbers between one hundred and two hundred and fifty. You can go one at a time, as fast as you can, one at a time. That's that's all I can think of. My brain is not working for some reason. So one at a time, 100 to 250. I hope that's clear. Wait for me to write start. Once I write start, I'll go from there. All right, so, and then we'll see who wins. That's the wrong word. Here we go. <clears throat> oh wait, marshmallow. Marshmallow. I got marshmallow. I got marshmallow. Is it marshmallow? Let me make sure here. What does Doc say? Oh, I gotta make sure. I gotta find it. Hold on. I thought I saw it. Oh yeah, all right, I got Marshall. All right, Marshall, 178 was the number. I hope that's right. Let me wait for clarification from the good doctor here. Do, 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 do. I didn't see anybody before that. All right, Doc. All right, Marshall, you're number one. <laughs> Michael, you're just almost there. <laughs> All right, so Doc, to Marshall, you are the first entry. So we do the the three people drawing. You you got your entry. Now that's not to say I don't think I'm not gonna. If you win Wednesday, you can have two entries. I don't care, but you won the first entry. So so we got one entry so far. There's gonna be two more. And remember, watch the video coming up. Go watch the old videos to get those numbers correctly on the other the other secret numbers. Yeah, I saw the 177, I think, David. I saw someone getting really close. <clears throat> and Wednesday, we'll try the numbers thing again for the videos. And then we'll do a Nubers on Wednesday. Wednesday's going to be a really, really late show because of uh, practice and stuff. So that's how that's going to go. All right. Okay, Michael, I think I'm going to get off of here too. I really appreciate y'all being on here and listening to me ramble for a little bit. Sorry I didn't have a whole lot of excellently cool stuff to show you tonight, but eventually it will be. Hey, Doc, thanks for helping me. Appreciate it. Y'all take it easy. And I will talk to you all on Wednesday.